Hey, what's up, everybody? I hope you guys are... Wait a minute. This is the wrong video. So I want to start off by saying, like I always do, I hope everybody's doing great. I know there's a tough situation going on around us right now, but we are all in this together and we are going to get through it together. And I'm going to tell you a better way we're going to get through it. We're going to get through it by painting pictures. And that brings me to why I'm making this video, because I just want to make sure that every single one of you know out there that I appreciate you so much and I am definitely going to be making more videos and more content now than ever. Now is the time where we need to get every single person involved with painting. We need to get a bunch of new beginners out there and we have to get them started. A lot of people are struggling right now mentally. This is some serious business taking place. We need to help these people. So do me a favor. All of the videos that we're putting out right now, we have live streams, we have Q and A's coming up. We need to get those videos. We need to share them, show people. You never know whose life you can change by sharing a video. You can share a video. Somebody could be suffering right now inside their home and they just feel like they, they, they're, they hit a block wall. Okay. You can sh not even just one of my videos, but I'm saying share, you can share any other positive video. Mine in particular is trying to introduce the gift of painting to people. You share the video, they see it, they think their life is over for a minute, all of a sudden they start painting and they're good to go. They feel good in the process so they keep doing it. And how do I know that? Everybody knows how I know that because that's what I lived. I lived through this and I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful. I'm so grateful to be sitting here, to be making this video, to be making these videos for you guys. I have some of the best fans in the world. You guys are, one, you know, one of the best things I ever did was put my phone number out there to be able to interact one-on-one -on -one with people, talk, hear their individual stories, hear how maybe I have affected their life. That, that type of thing, it, it touches me, it moves me, and it just makes me, no matter how hard my life may get or could be at some times, it makes me never want to give up. It's one of the best things that I have ever done, and I want to thank you for it. I'm not going to make this video long. I just wanted to make, I just wanted to make this known. I wanted to make it known to you guys that I appreciate you. The people that buy my paintings, unbelievable. I just, I can't thank you enough. I can't thank you enough. You mean the world to me. And hopefully, I can just, I can just keep doing what I'm doing. You know, share the videos, get them to other people, let somebody else experience that feeling. It's so, so, so important. Share the videos, not just mine, other inspirational videos. Anything that has to do with painting is key. Painting is key. Hobbies are great, but painting, painting is the way out. And I think most of you watching this video right now, you already know that. We all know that. We're a team. We're a family. And we're going to get through anything. doesn't matter what it is. So with that, I'm going to get on out of here. I'm going to go make me a coffee, get ready for the Q&A, all that good stuff. And I think that's about it. So, all right, I'm out of here. I love you guys. Thank you sincerely from the bottom of my heart. You guys mean everything to me. Subscribe, like, share. I'll see you in the very next video. All right, I know you guys probably don't want to wait an extra two minutes. So, just clicked over 703. All right, I know. All right, good, I can hear myself. How are you guys doing tonight? I hope everybody's doing great. Hope you liked that little intro video. I thought it was kind of fitting. You know what I'm saying? Um, screen is looking green. That is a good thing. Good, good thing. Um, all right, so. 
So for those of you guys who uh, who was here last night, I figured, um, all right, so I have this project I wanna do. I'm not doing that project tonight because that'll be a two part thing. So um, you guys saw, well, if you're on YouTube, you saw the little thumbnail thingy. Let me turn this volume down, hold on. All right. You guys saw the little thumbnail. I thought it was a little paint, a little ocean or something, you know? I thought that would be, uh, be a fun thing. So let's go ahead and not waste any time because we got lots of stuff to do. Share the video if you want. Do, uh, do all that stuff if you'd like to. Share, like, subscribe. It's your life. Do what you want. No, I'm just kidding. I mean, I'm not kidding. Um, let me see here. That's kind of rough. I'll save that for later. Hold on. Let me just uh, kick the screen up here so I can see some stuff. Yeah, last night was a total failure, and that's okay because I failed at a lot of things in my time, and I'm okay with failure. You got to uh, got to be able to accept failure. Can you guys hear me? Okay, somebody drop me a good old uh, comment down there with a thumbs up or something. Here's the palette, real quick. Uh, we're gonna get right to it tonight. I'm not gonna be lazy. So we got white, Prussian blue, phthalo blue. Uh, it's midnight black. I'm gonna burn umber, sap green, cad yellow, yellow ochre. That's uh, on the run. And uh, what is that? Indian yellow. Uh, bright red and crimson. So those are the. So those are the colors. All right, you can hear me. Hey Nick, what's up, buddy? Rhonda, I see all you guys. Every, uh, Matt, Becky, Dina, Lori, Ken. All right, good to see you guys. Good to see. You. Always happy to see you. Always happy. Uh, happy to see you, and I bet you're happy to see me when I'm not lagging. With the old circle, you know. <clears throat> Um, I didn't put anything up here. I, I put no medium on this uh, canvas. So let me get some of this stuff over here real quick with a paper towel. Uh, all right, I'm going to try to look over at the comments. I do that all the time, but the more I look at the comments, uh, the more I don't do anything up here. So I want to try to do something. So I'll, I'll peek down at the comments. If, I, if you ask a question, if I don't answer, I'm not a rude guy. You know, if you know me, I like to make people happy. So, if I don't answer your question, send me a text or something, you know? Send me something. Um, let me get this started here and I'll tell you something that could be important or could not be one or the other. And uh, I figured I would make an important announcement. I quit drinking Red Bull. It's been almost, uh, well, since that last time you saw me drink it. I quit drinking Red Bull. Don't, I don't know why, just 56 grams of sugar. Can you believe that? Uh, yeah. 56 grams of sugar in one of those little teeny tiny bottles. Yep, that'll do it. That'll do it. So yeah. Who needs Red Bull? I'll just drink water. So, yep, no more of that stuff. I just, I'll be honest, I didn't, um, I didn't really like it, like it that much, um, but I did, oh, that's falling apart. I did like the uh, the cranberry kind, but to my advantage, they don't make it. They, they stop, or they just can't get it, can't deliver it. I don't know, they're on back order because of the virus. I'm not quite sure what's going on with that, but, that uh, <clears throat> that kind of told me something, you know? It was like a sign, and I say it all the time, you gotta pay attention to the signs in life, because boy, let me tell you, there are signs everywhere. You just gotta think with an open mind, and you gotta find them signs. Yeah, so. So anyways, not a bad person. I just, uh, I liked it. I had no clue it was that bad either. How's that look? Pretty good. Nice and shiny. Um, all right, let me figure out how to get my life in order here real quick. Everything looks good. There's no uh, none of this stuff happening. Like that stuff, it looks pretty good. All right, so this is an interesting uh, sky. Oh, what, I, what I did, by the way, in case you want to know, I just put this uh, stuff on here, this uh, uh, oil paint medium. Good old Bob. Thanks, Bob. Good uh, medium right here. It's 
for it's for painting flowers, but I I've been using it a little bit. Um, I was going to put some clear gel from Gamblin. If you that's great stuff, by the way, um, you can use that as well. Um, all right, so we're going to do an ocean. Did I put that anywhere? Seascape ocean. I know I did on uh, on YouTube. So let me just stand back and think for a second about this sky, because before you start doing anything, you should always like think about it and you know figure out the best direction to take in your life. Um, or you don't have to, you could just kind of wing it. I, I wing everything pretty much. Uh, looks pretty good. Two inch, let's grab a two inch brush. Now the outside, here's the, uh, okay, a uh, little disclaimer. I sold this painting a long time ago, um, but this awesome company decided to send me prints. And amazing, right? So they sent me this and, and another one, and I was like, wow, that's pretty cool. It looks, it actually looks pretty legit. So I thought I would do uh, another one because I kind of miss it, the one that I sold. And it looks so pretty on the wall, the colors, and I don't have it anymore. So I'm going through a little bit of separation anxiety at the moment. Uh, blue, all right. Now, <clears throat> let me just say something here. Uh, I'll say something in a minute. Let me get started. You guys don't want to hear me say anything. You're not here for that. You're here for this. All right. So this is some Thalo. How the hell do you pronounce this? Thalo? Pahalo? Blue? I'm not, I'm not sure. So glad to have you guys. So I meant what I said in that little video in the front. In the front, in the beginning. I really do. I'm happy with everything. All you guys, I mean, it's just, it's a great community. There's a, you know, there's a few, uh, there's a few interesting ones that pop in from time to time, but we love them as well. All right, I'm wiping this off because I don't want to use a whole lot of this. Did I get the right color? Yeah, I got the right color. All right, I'll probably start. Now I'm going to keep be looking off to the to the that side right there, so I can take a look at what's going on. And these are never exact, okay? They are never, ever, ever exact. Mm. Yeah, that's a problem. Didn't have any there. Maybe some there. Now look, I'm just doing something really ugly for a moment. Just give me a second. I promise you, I will bring something together out of this. So, hmm. all right. And I'm gonna try to look down at, at comments, you know, I'll try to pop down and check them out. But like I said, if I start reading questions, I, you know, it becomes distracting to everybody's life, including mine, which I do love reading questions of my phone numbers at the top. See, right over there somewhere. All right, already lost. Already lost in what I'm doing here. Okay, so uh, let me just do something here real quick. Do you see how, do you see how this is real scratchy looking? Can you see that on camera or no? <coughs> Excuse me. Very scratchy looking, right? So let me just show you a quick way to sort of fix that right there without without blending. And by the way, share the video if you want, it would help. I love when people see this stuff. It gives me the motive to make more of these live videos. All right, so look, here we got a handy dandy little one inch thingy, right? Just take some white paint, you see that right there? Some white paint right there. And we can get rid of these scratchy looking things simply, simply, easily, whatever the word is. I'm just gonna kinda go like that. Come back up here. I'm just getting more. I'm probably not going to hold the palette. I suck at holding the palette. In case anybody doesn't know that. I'm just moving stuff around here. I hope everything looks good. I hope everything sounds good. Comcast, don't let me down tonight, hopefully, because this is uh, not going to be that long. White paint. That's all I'm doing here. All right. White, white, white. That's it. I'm just kind of saying, just moving it around. I gotta set this palette down before I do something wrong. I'm trying to get a visual, getting a visual. So I'm here, but you see what this white's doing? It, I'm hitting like the edges and, and we'll blend it in you know, I'm just putting it where it needs to be at the current moment right now. Um, one of the things I forgot to tell you is if you don't mind, uh, let me know where you are watching from because these live streams, I go back and I watch them and I just really love to see where everybody is in, in the world. You know, I am uh, 
Okay, in case you didn't know, I am located in the middle of nowhere. Um, well, technically, I'm in like a heavy populated city right at this moment, um, considering I live about, you know, 900,000 pine trees to the south from here in the middle of nowhere. So the town, it's a small town I'm in now, too, where the shop is. But it's technically, you know, this would be like a very busy city-like setting compared to what I'm used to. All right. I'm not making sense. I just like talking. I like talking to you guys. Is that okay? I like talking. I like getting stuff, you know, off my chest and just speaking. I spent so many years alone in my own head, you know, that I like talking now. And sometimes that'll get you in trouble, so you got to be careful with that. Now, something that I did ass backwards is I started with the blue, and I should have started with the yellow. Um, I don't know if I did that on purpose, but I just want to show you that it, that's fine. It's not a big deal. Um, so this is going to be a little bit different. I'm going to put some yellow right somewhere around there. All right, let me move over to that real quick. I'm going to take a fan brush here real quick, and I'm just going to grab some, yeah, cad, uh, yeah, cad yellow, cad yellow. I'm going to try to fix this here because I already broke it. So I'm just going to get a little bit of there, a little bit of, yeah, that made sense, a little bit of there. I'm going to get a little bit of there on the fan brush, and I'm just going to pop some of this. Whew, man, that's bright. Put some there. Now, if this turns green, no big deal. I'll put a cloud over it. Um, all right, I see what I can do with that. That's way too much yellow, and that's no problem. We'll fix it. So I'm going to go right from there to, like, uh, it looks like Indian yellow and a tiny bit of red. So I'm just gonna, I'm gonna go right into this Indian yellow right here. I'm actually gonna go like this. I'm gonna wipe this off. And okay, please do not call me. I'm in the middle of a live stream. I have no clue who you are. I keep getting these things that say um, spam. Do you get that on your phone? This may call this spam, S-P-A-M. I'm like, why am I gonna, I'm not gonna answer that. So look, I'm just getting the color around here at this point. Something's gonna have to go there because if I go over that, it is going to uh, turn green. All right, wipe that off into the red. Little tiny bit of red. Okay, just get, that's a lot. That's not a little tiny bit, but that's okay. You see, one of the things I like to do is I like to get the colors on here and then I, I like to work it in. You know, it's like a challenge just get all the colors down and then you work them in. I'm sorry if I sound like I'm stuttering um, it's because I'm trying to look down at my, my phone goes crazy every minute of the day it seems like it's over here vibrating like crazy I either have a phone call a text a this a that I mean most of it's like you know good nice feedback type of stuff but I got to figure out how to silence all that when I'm in the middle of something like a live stream okay I can't use that let me just go ahead and get this old brush right here all right, I'm going to start to try to blend some of this stuff in real quick. But before I do that, let me just sneak over here. I'm just going to grab, see the knife? I just put a little bit of white paint on here. I just want to just get some white paint in here. See? Just to work, you know, now I can work with it. All right. Oh, there he is. Bram's here. Bram is here. Happy Trees Art by Bram. I say this in every video. I, sh I should just start putting this in the title. If you guys want to see an excellent painter, make sure that you go over and subscribe to his channel, okay, because he does a lot of interesting, uh, good stuff over there, you know, good tutorials on mountains and, and uh, a lot of good stuff. So make sure that you head over there. Um, he's a really, really good dude. And then you got Nick right below him. Keep your eye on him because he's going to be famous one of these days, real soon, guaranteed. But now very good people, so make sure that you head over and, and show them guys some love. You know what I mean? I said this earlier, we're all a team, right? Everybody, you know, we're a big team. We all got to help each other, get along, and try to make the world a better place. All right, I'm just trying to blend this in. And like I said, if I hit green there, I'm not, I'm not crazy worried about it. Just want to get some of this yellow moving around up here. All right, I see a little green, and that's no problem. I'm not worried about it. Not worried about it. Uh, what do I do right there? Let me do this real quickly. You know, you can use the knife for stuff too. You see? 
I need a little color. See, just set it there with a the knife. It's not a, not a big deal. It doesn't always have to be perfect with a, with a brush, like a paintbrush. You don't always have to put, you know, apply it with the brush. You could use your finger, you could use a knife, it doesn't matter. Whatever's in your hand, you can use it. All right. I'm just gonna blend this in. Now I know this looks like garbage. Just bear with me. All right, we can work with that. We can work with that. <clears throat> All right, I think um, before I go too crazy here, let me let me keep continue working that blue in, which I should have done first. But that's all right. That's all right. Looking good on the stream. Everything is looking healthy. All right, here we go. Um, work some of that in there. There. There's all kinds of stuff over here. And I'm just working some color in, and it takes a very tiny, tiny bit of color, you know, with this blue. It's very strong. No, this isn't. Oh, <laughs> I thought somebody. I, no, I, I thought somebody was asking that question. I didn't see that it was you. Um, all right, let's try this. Maybe this one-inch brush and get some more white paint. Actually, let me do something. I'm just going to take some of this gambling white. I was using uh, some of this uh, Bob, the Bob white, old Bob white, and it was just a little thicker because there was a hole in the tube, and some of it, uh, some of the oil leaked out, so it was a little thick. So, gambling is going to rescue me from that situation. That's the paint that I use all the time. The re, like a lot of the times I use the Bob Ross paint, it's because I have so much because when I first started painting, I spent close to $1,000 the very first time I ever went to the store on Bob Ross paint. And it's very, very good paint. Um, I don't know about the newer stuff because I don't use it. But uh, Gamblin is uh, the number one for me. Uh, very, very good paint. And I really like them guys over there because they put a lot of work into what they do and they. They really, uh, they believe in their, you know, they believe in what they do. Just bear with me. We're going to put a big cloud in in a minute, like a big old cloud. I'm just trying to get this white paint smeared around so I can set the foundation for, um, to make it a little bit, you know, easy. So the white is just kind of killing this color down, like dulling it down a little bit so it's not so vibrant, which vibrant isn't always a bad thing either. But, and then I'll, I'll probably blend this out. I'm just, you know, twirling it away. Just twirling my life away right here. It's a lot of work, actually. Whew. So I don't know if you guys want to share the video. If you haven't done that already, maybe give me a thumbs up, a thumbs down, a middle finger, whatever you're feeling tonight is fine with me. Um, I'd be happy with anything, something. And the reason that I ask those things is because when you do that, it helps, uh, it helps YouTube understand that people, maybe they like the video, so it, uh, they push it, you know, they send it to other people. So that's why I ask you to give it a like and a thumbs up, or like I said, even a middle finger if they have one of those options. But either way, but no, for real, the thumbs up button is really what helps me, and I would greatly appreciate that. All right, I think that's good right there. Let me have a look here. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Maybe I can salvage and use this one. I've got some of these older brushes kind of laying around that I've had for years. Thank you, Rhonda. I know you're always you're always good for that stuff. Appreciate it. All right, let me see here. see how this works there was a little bit of yellow on here I do not recommend uh, don't do that use a clean brush if you're blending I just like living on the edge so ooh, seems ready to take off I'll darken the corners up here in a minute just smoothing that up you know getting that nice light color in that I was looking for and then we'll darken that color up here in a second with what? What are we gonna use? 
Probably use that two inch brush. Nice little brand new one, huh? Look at that, nice little hairs on it. I love that, the new brush smell. Bad idea. All right, Prussian blue. Let's get a little bit of that color. Another strong color. Paper towels, wipe it off. I'm not talking very, I am talking a lot tonight, but I'm actually painting instead of uh, stopping what I'm doing. All right, look, see, a little in the corner there. Let's bust a little over here as well, maybe a little bit more. All right, all right. Mm, let me just grab my water right here real quick. I gotta say, I love, uh, I love my life. I don't know about you guys, um, but I absolutely, <clears throat> excuse me, I love my life and I hope that you love your life as well. Because if you really sit back and think about it for a minute, there's a lot of, a lot of things to be happy about. I pass people every day in the street that are miserable and I feel so sorry for them. I just wanna you know, talk to them and say, hey, you know, what can I do for you? How can I help you? I'm serious too. I love the fact that I've had different perspectives on life. You know, five years ago, I hated everything. I literally hated everything, including myself. And now um, I can appreciate everything because I can look back and see all the things that, you know, that I wasn't happy with and all the things that I ruined. Yeah, I look over. Yeah, no, I, I see that. Uh, Darren, I see that, absolutely, and that's a great idea. Maybe I'll have to do that. I'll have to get one of the little Joby stand things and try to uh, mount it up there because, listen, I love to interact with you guys, and I think if I don't, <coughs> excuse me, if I don't do that, maybe something would be nice to have, you know, somebody reading off everything to me. Um, so that would probably be a great idea. Uh, yeah, right there. Now, with that said, let me just say something here. Let me figure out what color this is first. Looks like we got a little... Ivory black, okay, who's vibrating? All right, ivory black, and I don't know if that's Prussian blue, we'll figure it out. So with, listen, with that said, um, I just uh, figured out something recently. You're going to, if you guys follow me, I would, I would recommend this um, if you want to. Head over to uh, my website, paintingsbyjustin.com and sign up if you want to sign up for like the newsletter, drop your email. I'm getting ready to uh, announce a very big thing, which will be virtual a virtual class, but it's not going to be like this at all. What you see here, this is just a live stream. A virtual class is going to be multiple angles, and it's going to be very in-depth and very, very detailed. It's a lot of work. You know, um, it's just been a lot of work. So if you are interested in knowing information, make sure you go to my website, sign up for the newsletter. I don't send out junk and spam. It is all painting related. Now I got to start putting some clouds in and then I'll start talking. How's that look? Looks horrible. Let me get some more. What color are you? Blue. Let's try some uh, phthalo blue in there. All right, all right. So if I miss a lot of questions, I go back after the streams. Let me see how this looks. All right, that's more. That's a little bit better. So I'm gonna use this fan brush here, all right? And I'm gonna do little twirly bird circle thingies, okay? Share the video, there's like barely any viewers on here. Um, and I, you know, I don't know what to say about that because I see other channels that have 10,000 subscribers and they have a thousand people watching. So I don't know if there's just something wrong with me or what, but um, share the video if you can. I would love for more people to watch. And I'm just trying to be super honest with you I like when people watch because I know that I reach more people and maybe more people will want to start painting or whatever. It just gives me that, uh, it gets me inspired to, to do more. If nobody watches, it, you know, I don't want to do anything. So please do that. That's why I'm asking you, I'm just being upfront with you here. That's why I'm asking you to share the video, like, and all that stuff. It's for a reason. And I would really appreciate it. All right, I'm just putting it in this dark color first, okay? See what I'm doing here? All I'm doing is these little circles. This is so easy. You just do, look, circles, little counterclockwise, little jobby things, see? All right? 
and I keep going. I'm just reloading with, I'm using Prussian blue and midnight black. All right, midnight black has a beautiful purple color, color to it, where ivory black is just like a you know, regular black. All right, <clears throat> and that's, I like the, uh, the midnight black a lot, actually, a whole lot. Get some more Prussian blue in there. All right, let me step back real quick and see. Now this is gonna look like garbage until, you know, until I get the actual shapes going and all of those things, okay? So bear with me. Bear with me. Okay, step back. So essentially, um, I'm just I'm just putting in this color. See, and if I hit into the yellow, it's not going to turn like super green right away because there is that black in there. So that does help. Um, and another disclaimer: um, I have no clue what the hell I'm talking about. So if I say something like, "Oh yeah, look, you can go in there with this color and it won't turn green," I may be wrong. I don't claim to, um, to be any kind of a good teacher or understand anything about art. I just do what makes me feel happy. So let me just throw that out there in case later on tonight somebody says, you don't know what the hell you're talking about. I will say, you, you are right. That's probably the most accurate thing you've said all week. Um, you know, but I, do what, I just do what makes me happy, and that's the truth. And man, this makes me happy. Make me happier if I uh, hit that color exactly where I want it. Another thing too, I don't know how many of you guys um, use Jerry's Art Artorama, 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 that's how I pronounce it, Artorama. I don't know how many of you guys use them, but um, go check them out. Great people over there. Um, from the corporate center in North Carolina, I, uh, the, uh, I think the owner, one of the owners or somebody, somebody, very, very good guy. I reached out and I've talked to him a little bit and uh, it's a very, it's like a, just a great company and uh, I will be supporting them, you know, with, you know, things that I need. And I just thought it was fantastic that I've gotten to speak to them and uh, I figured, you know, go head over, check them out, you know, very, very good people, very good people. I keep looking over, I, I don't need this to be exact, I need more black in my life here, here we go, right there, midnight black on the way, see? It's that green from going everywhere. But yeah, they're, uh, I had some very, very nice talks, you know, with them and they're just great people, you know? So we'll see. Maybe uh, one of these days I'll have, I don't know, hey, maybe I can come up with something and start, uh, have like a brush line in their stores or something. I don't know, I don't know. All right, now, let me uh, change the plan here. I'm going to scoop up some white paint. I'm going to lighten this color up a lot. All right, and the reason I'm going to do that is uh, I don't really know, but it just sounds right and feels right and looks right to the right. A lot of rights there. A lot of rights. See, I'm just literally just circling it like crazy. No, I don't want no blue. No more blue. Black. Midnight black, white. Everything looks green on the screen. We're in good shape. A little bit there, maybe a little, leave a little opening, something like that. Now I got to say this too. Um, this year is going to be a hell of a year, okay? So it's going to be a hell of a year. My five-year-old daughter says hi. You tell her, Eric, that I said hello. Hey, Hayden? Is that her name, Hayden? Oh, I don't know. Hello? I don't know what you said you did. It's retracted that. But tell her I said hi. I just looked over and saw that. I love when, um, I love when kids start to, uh, start to paint because it's like, a, it's like this magical thing, you know, when um, you know, kids actually get into painting. It's just incredible. And uh, I wish I would have when I was a kid, you know. I wish I would have got into it. Now I'm just kind of refining things, see? I'm also, actually, I'm, I'm just putting circles in. That's all I'm doing. See these little circles? We're gonna bring this to life here in a second. These, it's pretty easy painting here. This is really easy. You know, you just have to get that mentality, like I say in probably every video that I've ever made in my life. You gotta have the mentality, don't worry about it. You know, cause uh, I know I'm gonna catch some shit for this, but I don't, think, I don't think my paintings are great. I don't think they're, I mean, I think 
Some of them may look presentable, but I don't think they're, they're good at all. You know, but I have a lot of fun doing this. And I think, if anything, that's what I'm, that's what I'm trying to get people to understand. You know, just, just have fun with it. Don't worry about how they look and, and all that. And I, and I love it because I don't have to, you know, ever feel like I'm trying to compete against somebody. You know, if, I mean, if that was the case, I would be in last place. There's a lot of good artists all over. And I love when you guys share stuff on Facebook and Instagram with me. It's just, it's just amazing. And there are so many of you that are so better, you know, if you look, you know, technically, you're so better than what I'm doing. And yet you're sharing your pictures with me and you're happy that I'm viewing them. And at the same time, I'm, I'm even more happy that you take the time to share that stuff with me. It means a lot to me. And I just want to, I want to thank you for that because it really does mean a lot. It brightens my day. So I'm very appreciative of all of you. You're, uh, said it earlier, wonderful people, very, very wonderful people. And I consider us a family. That's how, that's how I consider us here. We're a, we're a tight uh, family. Let's see. Okay. You guys are in your little conversations. That's good. All right. So here's what we have. We have a big blob of something happening here, right? I just need a little bit more black. I just want to refine this a little bit more and just bring some stuff into here like this. See, bring this down. It just looks better. All right. Something like that. A little twirler there and here and there. See? Okay. All right. Now let me, uh, Think about this for a minute. So yeah, if you guys didn't share the video, go ahead and do that. You know, I'll probably uh, be very annoying because I keep saying that because it actually, it means something to me. So it's almost like a favor. I'm asking you to do it like a free uh, favor. You know, just a little push button of the finger, thumbs up, share, you know, that would be great. I was going to do something funny. I was going to uh, start the video and just stand in front of the camera and say, we will start as soon as we hit 150 viewers and 300 likes, but I could never do that to you guys. I'm not that kind of person. I do have a sense of humor. I love having a good sense of humor. I try my best to have a good sense of humor. All right. I'm just going to go ahead and use another fan brush. I'm just trying to, I already got a big pile of messy brushes, which is fine. Um, all right, grab the water. All right, I'm going to get a fan brush and I'm going to start putting in clouds. Well, you know, the, uh, the light part of the clouds. So let me get another fan brush here. Number three is my favorite in the world. Number three fan brush. You know what? Let me just do something real quick. <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm just going to going to wipe that off real quick. I just don't feel like dirtying up everything in my life tonight because I'm always in a hurry. Then when I'm, as soon as I'm done this, I got to, I could literally have to run out the door. You know? But yeah, number, th number three fan brushes, just like one of my best friends ever. All right, here we go. So it looks like I have, there's some white and there's also a little crimson there. I'll start off with the white. Let me just get me a big old scoop of it. We'll just use the Bob white since it's good and thick and I'll get it I'm just gonna get a tiny